Good evening, everyone. My name is Jordan Corral, and I will be presenting to you Dominion, a documentary film uh, released in 2018, and you can view it on YouTube at no cost. I must warn you all that there are graphic images that I will be showing you. Uh, the documentary itself contains many uh, images and video recordings that are very difficult to watch, but are necessary uh, for change. The central thesis of the documentary, billions upon billions of animals, uh, bred for food, entertainment, and clothing uh, on a yearly cycle that is ethically and morally challenging, unsustainable, and catastrophic to our health, the welfare of animals, and ultimately life of our planet. The first primary type of evidence is that of testimony. The activists were physically at slaughterhouses and breeding facilities throughout the film. We see here taking place in a slaughterhouse, a pig being electrocuted. Uh, this pig is in pain. Throughout the film, activists go undercover as workers with hidden cameras and microphones. Uh, another tactic is that of placing uh, hidden cameras and microphones uh, throughout facilities uh, that otherwise um, would be unseen by the public. Here are more images taken by activists in person, their testimony being trustworthy. Uh, these images reveal what is truly going on behind those concrete walls. Uh, the image to the left is that of a dairy cow, uh, one that has been slaughtered. Uh, that was taken with a hidden camera and a microphone as well being in place to record sound. Uh, the image on the upper right corner is that of a broiler chicken. Um, as you can see, it is carrying so much weight that it cannot uh, stand on its legs. It cannot hold its weight properly. And that chicken is very much alive. You see that much throughout the film. Chickens in that, uh, in that setting. The image in the lower right corner is that of a waste bin uh, containing piglets, dead piglets, uh, fetuses, uh, limbs, and organs that otherwise are not going to be used for human consumption, but instead uh, likely sent to rendering facilities that would render that awful um, to be put into pet food uh, or fish meal, which would then be fed to fish that humans will consume later. Another type of evidence is that of statistics. Uh, the narrators explain in great detail the grand scale in numeric format of how many animals are bred for food, clothing, entertainment, research. Uh, the image here is of a pork facility. Uh, one such place can contain upwards of 25,000 pigs at any given time. And also at any given time, uh, there may be upwards of 780 million domesticated pigs alive on planet Earth. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, dogs, man's best friend, another species exploited by humans here and throughout the world. In the United States alone, the popular breed beagle dogs, which are presented in the films, um, are unfortunately another statistic. Upwards of 70,000 are bred a year for research, for uh, animal testing, uh, sport, and ultimately will be put to death uh, within months or years of life um, of abuse. In conclusion, uh, this is a tough documentary to watch. It is absolutely a necessary film that has the right mechanisms in place uh, to persuade even the most toughest of critics, um, hopefully to question their choices and your choices. Uh, the evidence, difficult to refute, uh, is powerful and lasting. Uh, if anyone has any questions, concerns, comments, please, comment um, for me to answer. I'm here for you. Um, there's also lots of, of information out there. And um, 
It starts with this film. Thank you.